it was coming eventually. They just weren't expecting it today. Nearly 200 people living at a homeless encampment near SJC got a startling wake up this morning. City crews moved in, started clearing out the site. NBC Bay Area's Tom Jensen spoke with some of the residents who questioned the timing and what they say was a lack of fair warning. Residents we talked to said they were shocked when city workers rolled in this morning and trucks pulling trailers that were loaded with dumpsters and heavy equipment and by 8 they were already going to work pulling up everything from cars to makeshift homes and crushing them on site. Residents of San Jose's Guadalupe Gardens homeless encampment said they never expected to wake up to the sounds of heavy equipment on a Saturday morning. Trailers, motorhomes, you know, just chewing them up and spit them out. A former resident who lives in an apartment now says she was visiting her boyfriend this morning when that equipment started getting closer and closer to their RV. It felt you, like yeah. I better let them know that we're in the RV because they might just take it out. They told us they were surprised because they thought they would have more time to clear out and never believe they'd be thrown out over the weekend with no warning. We've known for a while that this has been coming. However, we were under the impression that we had until the end of the month. City officials tell NBC Bay Area the FAA mandated them to clean up the site or face the possibility of losing federal funding and began the initial cleanup last year. And since March, they have removed more than 1.3 million pounds of debris and at least 84 cars and trucks that didn't run. Meanwhile, a local nonprofit group that provides interim housing and on site showers and toilets and laundry services said they'll continue to help even after this encampment is cleared. We'll look and see where we're needed the most and be willing to go there. Uh, we'll also be willing to try to help the people who were here. Uh, we have other resources where we have counseling and counselors that come out and help. A spokesperson for the city manager's office says San Jose outreach teams have already helped about 150 people from the encampment find interim permanent housing and they continue to seek shelters for the remaining residents. She says she expects the 40 acre site to be completely cleared by the end of the month. In San Jose, Tom Jensen, NBC Bay Area News.